Hi guys, I'm Guðmundur Kristjánsson, creative director and co-founder of 1939 Games. I'm here with you today to discuss a little bit the state of cards and, and uh, what we are working on and, and what we are thinking about here at 1939 Games and, and kind of our focus these days. Uh, obviously, we learned a lot of things uh, since the release of the game in April. Uh, although some of us have been in the gaming industry for quite a long time, uh, 1939 Games is a, is a young company and Cards is our first game, so, so we are uh, learning a lot of things every day. Um, I would say maybe the biggest thing that we've learned uh, and, and what we are kind of focusing on now is that it's not enough to just focus on the on the core card game itself, uh, although I mean we're very happy with what we've been doing there, but we've been focusing so much on that that we've been uh, maybe neglecting a little bit the, uh, the other parts of the, of the whole uh, cards journey, including uh, uh, the economy and, and, and how you, you know, collect cards and things like that. And, uh, how the journey of new players is into the game. That is something that we really want to improve. And I think we have a, a, a good list of, of, of uh, ideas on, on how we're going to do that. And of course, we've already started. Uh, we've, of course, made the game a little bit more stable by fixing a, a ton of bugs. Uh, which we had, uh, you know, following the, the release of, of Theatres of War, where we were just focusing so much on, on that expansion. And uh, also, uh, since I'm talking about Theatres of War, uh, we listened to the feedback from our community and, and, and with, uh, you know, the decision to make all the Theatres of War cards craftable, I think was a a uh, good decision, and uh, I, I hope all of you guys are crafting those honeys so, and uh, these cards you want to have. Uh, I mean, I think we learned a little bit uh, from that uh, exercise that we can maybe not take it for granted to, to do something that some of the, the bigger studios there are doing uh, in, in, the, in the genre. Um, yeah, we had a patch today which included uh, the login rewards, uh, which is a feature for new players. Uh, basically, you get uh, quite meaningful rewards each day you log in. And this is uh, part of a bigger project uh, or a bigger effort on our half behalf to uh, make life a little bit easier for new players and, and get them uh, up and running uh, a bit faster. So uh, the login rewards include pretty meaningful stuff like uh, elite special cards and gold cards and uh, packs and stuff. And uh, since we don't want anyone to miss out, uh, you guys are of course included and everyone gets, you, you old dogs also get the rewards. The future, of course, holds a lot of uh, super exciting things, in our opinion. Of course, we're working on uh, the, the, the bread and butter stuff, like uh, a new expansion that will uh, include a lot of new cards and uh, some nice, interesting mechanics. But uh, I want to talk more about the, the kind of the other stuff today, because I mentioned new player experience, which is uh, uh, a journey uh, for each nation or kind of a progression path that starts right from the beginning, which includes how you uh, unlock the starter packs, uh, but then you continue uh, progression on a national level where you collect cards for that nation and, and uh, props and stuff related to that nation. So players are, are, are given the opportunity to be in a bit more of control of, of where they want to take their collection. And that is kind of a theme that we're trying to work also into the economy. Uh, for example, we'll definitely be uh, introducing wildcards into the game, uh, which allow players to focus their, their collecting efforts better. Uh, more about that later, but, but uh, those are all, you know, 
it's it's uh, we want to work on the on the whole journey of playing cards not only the the core card game itself I'm Guðmundur Kristjánsson. Uh, it's been great to have you here. Uh, thank you for tuning in and see you in the battlefield.